then back to the beginning. This time, instead of just playing the two notes, we're going to play half of a C chord. So it's a C chord, but without the third finger. And the third finger is going to come down on the um, bottom string, second fret. So it's then the C position at the third, rising to the seventh. And then you can either go back into that. Or you could do this. So we're going um, fifth str uh, fourth string, second fret, open, fifth string, third fret, and fifth string, first fret. change slightly on the second string uh, on the second uh, verse we come down to the fourth position and we're playing the second with the with our bar we're playing the second and the third string and we're adding in the fourth string at the sixth fret so we're playing um, the, the, the top the root and the second and third string we're just playing the fourth string on its own. Add the next finger in on the fifth fret. Then the, the little finger in on the sixth fret. Then take it off. So that sounds like this. going to add the pinky in at the 6th fret and pull off to the 4th fret which is barred. Then we're coming up to the 6th fret with a minor bar chord. It doesn't really matter how you play this, you can play it with your thumb or with your, with your nail, whichever, or you can play with separate strings, whatever suits you. So, so we play the chord, then the second string, then the third string, then the second string, then we add the pinky in at the ninth position, and we change to an F bar shape. So again. And then I normally do this. the sixth string and the fourth and the third together. So we're going. Or whatever strings you like. Then the uh, uh, sixth string and the pinky on the second string at the ninth position. Then back to the minor chord. Third and second string. Then the first string. Then we're coming back to the F shape, but we're adding in the pinky finger at the ninth position. Whatever you want to do there. So we're going from the pinky at the ninth to the seventh. And then we're going back to the minor chord. And we're adding in the sixth note. Then we're moving the whole thing up and doing a minor bar chord in the ninth position. Still playing that top note. And adding in the ninth fret and taking it off again. And then playing the second string. Then we're going to a 
not an F shape, but uh, an F shape without the pinky. And I normally play the strings with my thumb from the fifth down to about the second. string, adding in the third string at the tenth position, pulling it off, and then adding the pinky finger at the tenth position on the second string and playing three or four uh, strings. Sounds quite nice. Pulling off. position so it's okay <coughs> and that's the end of the second section so away that second section so far Just starting with the E third section we're going to go into um, something slightly different, a bit of strumming. So we're going to strum with a bar chord at the 7th position, A bar chord. Then we're going to move to the 8th position for the F. Start off slow. So all we're doing there is going back to the E and the C, but with the added in note, then back to E, then back to C. So. And that's the end of the Goldfinger section, then we can move into the Bond uh, theme tune, which uh, is down here in the second position. Mm -hmm. 